Yo, what's up guys, Drollby here and today I'm going to show you step by step how you can make Phantom Wallet. Like you all know, I'm usually on Ethereum but a lot of people started to switch to Solana and you probably all heard about Solana Summer. So because of all of that, I don't want to miss it and today I will show you how to create Phantom Wallet. So first step which you need to do, you need to go to Google and you need to type Phantom Wallet Chrome extension. So once you type this, you're gonna immediately have it over here, please be careful if if you don't have ad blocker it could be that this first is same link but with ad and it could happen that you get scammed so please make sure that you are on right link and once you click on it over here you have add to chrome but before that make sure that they have a lot of users again to make sure that you are not getting scammed by wrong link and then you click add to chrome and then add extension. So once you click over there, you want to create new wallet because if you're over here and you're watching, you don't have your wallet. And also go on this puzzle over here and uh, over here you can see phantom wallet and just click over here. And then every single time when you go, go to your Chrome, your phantom will be over here. So you don't need to waste your time. And now we can create a new wallet. It's pretty, pretty simple because most of you probably already have MetaMask so it's kind of similar but let's continue over here you need to type your password then you agree to terms of service and you continue and over here this is really important this is your seed phrase you should take your paper in real life and type all these words in that paper do not storage it on your pc because it could happen that you get hacked and that they found your secondary seed phrase and then you will lose everything so once you type all of these words, please make sure that they are all correct. Go through them like three times. And then once you saved it, you just click over here and you continue. So this over here is shortcut. Basically, if you press Alt, Shift and P in same time, your phantom wallet will pop off. But since you already did this with puzzle, it's always over here. So you'll probably not use this. Then continue. And over here, last step, you can follow them on Twitter. Simple ad by them and you just finish. So once we are done, if we click over here, um, this is our wallet and like you can see, we are unable to fetch token prices. So if this happened to you, basically they are down right now, but to be completely honest, when you are doing it, everything will be fine. Basically right now, a lot of people are complaining. So I will just need to wait a few minutes before I continue. And if you have any other questions, you can go on Twitter and follow me. Link will be in the description, but my Username is Drollby Crypto. All right, so it took around 30 minutes, but right now we are finally back and everything is all right. So I'm actually glad because this happened because now you can see that you don't need to panic if that ever happened to you. So then like you can see, wallet is pretty similar like MetaMask over here. You will have your tokens. In second page, you will have your collections like NFTs. In third, you can swap. In fourth, you can see your activities. And in last, usual settings, you can remove your wallet and so on. So first thing which I want to do is if you are in Solana, you will probably do NFTs and you will probably mint a lot. And if you want to mint, you probably want to go over here and here you can see your wallet one and over here add connect wallet. If you press this, basically you can create a new wallet. So you can see connect your ledger, import existing wallet, and over here, most important, create a new wallet. So ledger, of course, safest way, but a lot of you don't have it. So you just create new wallet and only with one click, you can see over here, I just made another address or another wallet. So if I want to mint, I don't want to mint with my main wallet where I have a lot of money. Of course, yeah, you, you can see I have zero. But if I want to mint, I always want to have second wallet, my burner wallet, like people like to call it. So you just transfer some Solana for minting. And if you connect it to wrong side to some scam site, if you didn't do your research, basically, you will lose only this small amount of soul, which you transferred instead of your main wallet where you have all your collections. So it's pretty, pretty simple. I suggest to you to never mint 
any collections on your main wallet. Of course, you can even make another Chrome and completely different wallet to be even more safe. And the uh, last thing which I want to show you is basically probably really important to you how you can found your wallet. So if you click over here on wallet one, it's gonna automatically copy your address. And of course, easiest way to transfer money to your Solana Phantom wallet is Binance. If you don't have Binance, I highly recommend you to use my referral link because you are getting 20% off fees for every trade you make. Since I'm affiliate, this is maximum you can get. And of course, Binance is probably safest exchange, so you should probably have it. But with this link, you can easily transfer Solana to your wallet and if you don't know how to do it there is my full tutorial how to use Binance so go watch it and there is also another solution basically subscribe to my channel because I will make another video how you can fund your wallet without using any investment so tomorrow I will upload video explaining how and of course, if you are watching this video few weeks from uploads, go check my videos. Because like I said, you can make money on Solana without investing anything. So go watch my other videos.